everybody, it's Tony, and I know I don't look the greatest today, but I'm cleaning. So, I am actually um, getting ready to use the Swiffer Sweeper Vac as part of a spark with my blog spark, and we're doing the Swiffer Double Action Clean Challenge. Now, along with me showing you how it works and how good it is, hopefully, I don't know, it's going to be my first time trying it. I'm also going to be giving away a $40 gift card to Walmart so you can pick up a Swiffer back for yourself if you would like. I mean, or you can do whatever you want with it. But we would love for you to pick up the Swiffer back so that you can try it and like it. Anyways, okay. So I've already put my Swiffer together because I didn't want to try to do that on camera and look like a big idiot. So here is the Swiffer. Hold on, let me turn this around. I've already got the little thing attached. As you can see right here, this is the little vacuum part, up and down, up and down. So when you're wanting to attach this, very easy. You just stick them into the little holes like that. You lift the back part up, set the um, set the little cloth down, set the swiver on top of it, stick it in the holes, lower the back down. This is where the um, the debris will go, I guess. And here's the box that it came in. And what it came with was course some of the refills which I have on there and it came with some cereal some synthetic hair good thing it's not real that would be kind of gross some food crumbs which looks like chocolate chip cookies yum and some dirt not sure if you can see that so I'm going to go sprinkle some of this on the floor and I will be back with you in just a moment okay as you can see I've got there's my hair my dirt my food crumbs or the cookies that are going to absolute waste and my cereal right there so now i am going to take my swiffer back and hopefully it's fully charged i hope so anyway sorry you can see my feet here it is so as you see we have make sure that snapped into place here's our on off button we turn it on it's free sorry it's loud now I'm going to get the, ooh, it's sucked up the hair. Now, I don't know if you have to lift the little. Oh, and that's a pain. So, let's see how it did. Hold on. I'm going to do the rest of my floor now. And I like you can swivel it. I don't know if you can, all you have to do is turn your hand and it swivels very easy. So you can get into the corners very, very easy. Right up against the wall. <laughs> and I did not do my floor beforehand so you can see exactly how much it picked up. I haven't swept it today. I don't even think I swept it yesterday. So it could be a little interesting. So you just go over your floor. This kind of makes me think of a Dyson ball, how easy it twists. Not that I would know. Okay, now we're going to turn it off. Now let's see what we have here. Inside the little thing. Right there, can you see everything? It's sucked up my cereal, my food crumbs, my dirt, and my synthetic hair. Um, to empty it, empty it, all you do is press the release button and you are good to go. Now let's look at the bottom. This is probably going to be disgusting, so I apologize in advance. My floor was probably dirty. Kids track and dirt. That's what happens when you have three kids that are outside, in and out, in and out. Ooh, and that was a clean pad. So you see, um, it, it vacuums this, this, there's a little vacuum up in here and um, it did miss one of the big crumbs but I think you can lift it up a little bit so it has a little bit of space between you and the floor and the little vacuum thing I think you could put like I don't know how you do it I'll have to look at it later but look at all of this look at all the dirt it picked up on here in addition to sucking the hair dirt food crumbs and cereal up into the little vacuum area very cool definitely two thumbs up from a daily dose on the Swiffer sweeper back so now I will tell you below how to enter to win the $40 gift card from Walmart. Have a great day.